What's up, everyone? Welcome to the December 26th edition of FanDuel Tournament Plays, brought to you by BetMGM. I'm your host, Adam Scherer. You can follow me on Twitter at ShipMyMoneyDFS. We have a seven-game NBA slate to break down tonight. As always, we're going to take a look at five of the top tournament options using the Boom Bust tool on the Stochastic.com website. But first, click the link in the description below. Sign up and make a deposit at BetMGM. Place a real money wager of at least $10 and receive a risk-free first bet up to $1,000 on that initial wager. Click the link in the description below to take advantage of this offer. As a reminder, there are going to be injuries, injury news rather, uh, hopefully not actual injuries, that would be weird, but there will be injury news between now and tip. So be sure to tune in to the Deeper Dive and Live Before Lock for more up-to-date information. But with the way things stand right now, looking at the Boom Bust tool, starting at number five, Paul George projected for 15% ownership with a 16% chance of being in the optimal lineup. He has shooting guard and small forward eligibility and will be playing against the Detroit Pistons tonight in a favorable matchup without Kawhi Leonard. George's production increases without Leonard this year, which is not surprising. He's $9,500 coming off of a game where he played about 35 and a half minutes. So we don't need to expect him to be on any sort of a minutes limit either. Number four, Marcus Morris, 12% projected ownership, 17% chance of being in the optimal lineup. He is just $5,100 with small forward and power forward eligibility. Morris also should see an uptick in production without Kawhi Leonard. And he's just a little bit underpriced here in a favorable spot against the Pistons. Number three, Anthony Edwards taking on the Miami Heat. So not the most friendly spot, but just a $9,000 price tag, shooting guard and small forward eligible. Edwards is projected for about 19% ownership with an 18% chance of being in the optimal lineup. Sticking with the Timberwolves, D'Angelo Russell is just $7,200. He's projected for 15% ownership with a 23% chance of being in the optimal lineup. He's $7,200 with point guard and shooting guard eligibility. Jordan McLaughlin remains out tonight for the Timberwolves. And when he's out, even though we don't think of him as a key part of the Timberwolves, we do get a lot more playing time for D'Angelo Russell. He's coming off of a game where he played 39 minutes, and I expect 35 plus minutes from him tonight, as long as this game is competitive. And number one, Anthony Simons, just $6,200 in a favorable matchup against the Charlotte Hornets. Simons production does take a hit when Damian Lillard is active, but the price tag has dropped a bit too far as Simon still averages close to a fantasy point per minute when he plays alongside Damian Lillard, and he should give you 35 plus minutes tonight. He's projected for 24% ownership with a 27% chance of being in the optimal lineup. So to recap, the top five tournament options on FanDuel as things currently stand, number five, Paul George, number four, Marcus Morris, number three, Anthony Edwards, number two, D'Angelo Russell, and number one, Anthony Simons. 